Sky reporter shares news of a deal for top striker that Liverpool wants. How much will Liverpool need to pay in 2025 if they want to sign a special superstar? Hello, Reds fan. Come check out the latest news from the world's biggest club. Let's dive into the video. It was reported that Liverpool conducted checks on Victor Gucaris during the summer transfer window, with the sporting Lisbon striker highly sought after following an impressive season in which he scored 43 goals. This performance attracted attention from several clubs, and it's believed that Liverpool are among the top four Premier League clubs especially interested in the top striker, who has started the current season in great form. Last Tuesday, journalist Florian Plettenberg shared an update on the Swedish player on X, stating that Giocares could be available for a fee between £50 million and £58 million if an offer within this range is made. According to Plettenberg, although there's a €100 million Euros release clause, there's an understanding that the player could leave sporting next summer for a fee between €60 Euros and €70 million. Euros. However, a transfer in the winter market seems unlikely at this time. Manchester City, Arsenal, Liverpool and Chelsea are the main interested clubs in the 26-year-old, and all have been informed of the conditions required for his signing. Giocares has not disappointed this season, continuing to deliver on last season's excellent form, so far amassing 18 goals and 7 assists for both Sporting and the Swedish national team. While the Portuguese league may be less demanding than the Premier League, scoring 12 goals in 9 games is remarkable including a crucial goal against Porto. Liverpool fans on social media have called for the club to invest in a centre-forward, especially following Diogo Jota's recent setback, with the player expected to be out until after the November international break due to an injury sustained in the win over Chelsea. The simultaneous absence of Federico Chiesa, who has had a challenging start at Liverpool marked by physical issues, has left manager Arna Slot with limited attacking options. This scenario highlights the need for the club to strengthen the forward line, and Giocares seems an attractive option. However, sporting coach Ruben Amorim's potential transfer to Manchester United could complicate Liverpool's plans. Amorim's departure could impact not only Giocares' release, but also that of Goncalo Inazio, another sought-after player. Thus, Liverpool's sporting director Richard Hughes will need a strong, convincing approach to secure the Swedish striker, who is already viewed as one of the best forwards available. It's highly likely that Gio Carries will make a big transfer move in 2025. Will it be to Liverpool? What do you think, fellow fan? Share your thoughts below. Liverpool might be looking for a replacement for Mohamed Salah next summer, and Florian Wirtz, Bayer Leverkusen's young talent, emerges as a top target. At 21, the attacking midfielder was essential in helping Leverkusen win the Bundesliga and DFB Pokal, as well as standing out for Germany at Euro 2024, which boosted his market value. Although Liverpool faces competition, with interest from Manchester City, a Reds offer could attract Wurtz. Leverkusen have set an initial price of £90 million for the player, who, with seven goals and one assist this season, has already justified his potential and the high valuation. For Liverpool, this fee may be worthwhile in the long term especially if scouts and the technical team see him as Salah's ideal successor and a future Premier League star. Liverpool's main challenge, however, will be beating rivals such as City and Real Madrid, who are also interested in the young player. For Wurtz, the Etihad Stadium or Bernabeu could be equally appealing destinations. Over the past 12 months, Wurtz has emerged as one of Europe's best players. For Liverpool, he could represent an ideal option should Salah decide to leave next summer. A comparison of Wurtz's and Salah's numbers since the start of last season shows both are delivering high-level performances with little difference between them, although Salah's record is more impressive, with more goals in fewer games. In terms of games played, Mohamed Salah has appeared in 57 matches, while Florian Wurtz has featured in 63, demonstrating Wurtz's consistency and importance to his team. Salah, with fewer games, has still managed to stand out in both goals and assists. When it comes to goals, Salah has scored 33, while Wirtz has recorded 25. Though close in total appearances, the Liverpool forward has been more efficient, with eight more goals in fewer games, reflecting his strong offensive presence and finishing ability. In assists, both players are tied at 21 each. 
This statistic shows that both are crucial not only in scoring, but also in creating plays and opportunities for their teams. In summary, while Salah's record is indeed impressive, Florian Wirtz proves to be a strong contender among elite forwards, maintaining a performance close to that of the Liverpool star across various metrics. This reveals Wirtz's immense potential as one of the top attacking talents, capable of competing with the biggest names in European football. Liverpool has an important decision to make next year regarding Salah's successor, and Wirtz emerges as a dream option for the Reds, as the 21-year-old is only beginning his promising career. Liverpool has shown strong interest in Brentford's Brian Mbiomo as a possible replacement for Mohamed Salah if the Egyptian star decides to conclude his time at Merseyside. Salah has been a central figure in the Reds' attack over the past seven years, dominating the right-wing position and outperforming all challengers. His departure, however, would leave a gap difficult to fill and put Liverpool in a period of uncertainty. Currently, the club relies on Federico Chiesa, signed to provide an alternative to Salah, but this transfer has proven complicated due to the Italian's propensity for injuries. It's in this context that Mbeomo stands out as a promising option. At 25, the Cameroonian has impressed since Brentford's first season in the Premier League in 2021. This season, Mbumo has already scored eight goals in nine games, ranking second on the scoring list, only behind Erling Haaland. With a mix of speed, tenacity, and skill in advancing against defenders, Mbeumo resembles Salah in some aspects, such as his diagonal runs and ability to make an impact in attack. Last season's statistics reinforce his potential. Mbeumo had an expected goals of 7.2 after 12 games, averaging just 2.8 shots per game. This data suggests that by joining a higher caliber squad, his offensive threat could be even further explored. A recent report from TalkSport has again linked the forward with Liverpool, although other clubs are also eyeing Mbeumo, such as Arsenal and Newcastle. Amid the growing interest, Brentford manager Thomas Frank has admitted that a transfer to a bigger club might be a natural next step for the player. Brentford has set a value of £50 million for Mbeumo, a figure that, considering his performance, could even seem a bargain by the end of the season. For fans, the hope is that Salah remains at the club. But if this does not happen, Brian Mbomo emerges as an attractive alternative, bringing a skill set that could help continue the Egyptian king's legacy on Liverpool's right wing. Liverpool fan, what do you think about this possible move? If Salah does leave Anfield, do you think Brian Mbomo would be the ideal replacement? Thank you very much for watching all the way through. Until next time.